So today's Friday, and you already know how Friday is, all right? It's been a long work week. People can't wait to unwind, to hit the malls, to hit the shopping, you know what I'm saying? Go to the club, go to the bar, spending time with the family and friends. But before you get to that, guys, I got a brand new farm that just launched today. At the time of the video, the APRs are still showing a thousand percent. I mean, a thousand percent. We're talking about Cedo Swap, and Cedo Swap, of course, is backed by the Dex Finance Spark Swap team. So you already know this is gonna be official. So I'm gonna give you a dab walkthrough, and I'm gonna give you maybe one or two strategies to help you out and show you how powerful the Cedo 44 token is going to be. So of course, this is Jam Pack. Hit that like, smash that subscribe for your boy, guys. We're gonna get busy and get straight into this video. Moonshot to the next, like moonshot next. Got him catching drip fever, make the room hot. Deck ice rack up stacks, my platoon fall back. No cap, I can make drip boom all caps. All right, so you already know I'm not a financial advisor. Enough of you guys saying this video is for financial advice. Ladies and gentlemen, this video is for entertainment purposes only. And you got to understand one thing. If you're not comfortable with losing money, then you don't really need to be watching this video. This is the DeFi sector. DeFi is high risk, but with high risk come high rewards. That's why we're able to farm at a thousand percent because there, there are risks when it comes to these platforms, right? When these token launch over here, like the CEDO token, we know that the token, you know, could go to zero, could go all the way up to a dollar. It could go sideways for a whole month. Who knows what's going to happen? I don't know. But I still play this game because I understand that when you jump into a good project, right? Especially when you jump into it early on day one, that's where you are going to maximize your gains and really make some good profits. And the team behind, you know, Cedo Swap is an experienced team. So that's why they already have their farms going. They already got their bridge. They got their swap. All the things are working out pretty, pretty good. If we take a look at the statistics over here, the market cap is at 364,000. And if we take a look at the TVL, we're, we are already at 649 thousand dollars now ask yourself a question the farm just launched like three hours ago but that's close to seven hundred thousand dollars in here and, and and the reason why is like i said because the team is an experienced team and there's a lot of good things happening over here right so if we go to the discord right so jumping into the discord over here guys they do have a telegram but there's a lot more interaction in the discord and frankly when it comes to the bull run right i like to go to the discords rather than the telegrams because there's a lot more information that's well organized. Like for example, if you wanna know all of the official links, they are right over here in this section, all the major announcements, as well as if you have any questions, you head to the general chat or you open up a support ticket, right? So for me, the Discord has a lot more information, but let's get straight to the information that you wanna have in order to participate in the farms. Number one, you're gonna to have to bridge over your tokens. But you can use change now, you can use other bridges out there to jump on the Manta network. But understanding that if you do use their Cedo swap bridge, you are going to receive some airdrops and airdrops of what? Of Cito tokens. And it's very important that you accumulate your Cito tokens for the next section that I'm gonna talk about a little bit later. So bridge using Cito swap and earn 2X of all bridge fees in USD value of Cito. With bonus airdrops for liquidity providers, airdrops will take place over one month period with weekly airdrop epochs. So every week, the more you use the bridge, the more you're gonna receive CEDO tokens, and the more you're gonna receive bigger and better airdrops, right? So, so it's very important to join that bridge and bridge over your funds. I do have a video that I did uh, a couple days ago that explains how to bridge, and I showed you everything on, on that bridge, so you should be good to go. So jumping into the bridge over here, guys, you can see that you can bridge from Arbitrum or BSC to Manta. Let's say we are on BSC, you have some USDC, and then you want to bridge it over to Manta to even get USDX, or you could bridge it to get CETO, or you could bridge it to get ETH. Now, you're gonna need some gas fees, so make sure that if you do bridge over your BSC USDC to get your ETH, that you're not bridging over a lot because of the price impact, right? So the gas fees are pretty cheap. The transactions are like five cents, three cents, 10 cents, depending on, you know, so it's not really that big of a deal to, to get a lot of ETH, unless you want to participate in the farms and you're gonna need a lot more ETH. So I would say 
please take a look at the price impact and what you will receive when you're bridging over because that takes away from the profits, right? So jumping into the farms right here, guys, let's take a look at the information here that is presented to us. And let's take a look at the APRs. So right now at the time of the video, we can see that the stable coin pair, right? The USDX and the USDC, that is paying 440.29%. Guys, you're talking about a LP stable pair that's paying out this much, that's paying over 1% a day. This right here is massive. Now, the CETO USDX, this one right here is paying 954%. That is up to what? That is up to like a 2.8% percent a day which is pretty good we've got the wrap eth manta which is paying 730 percent then we have the what the strategic ai token paired up with the manta that's paying 917 percent and we know the strategic ai token are the truth seekers tokens that was bridged from bsc to the manta blockchain now the cito wrap eth we're at 1025 percent but one of the great information that you got to take a look at is the what the multipliers right if I go to the stable pair, the multiplier of the token emissions is 11x. CETO USDX is 22x. The wrap ETH Manta is 8x. The strategic AI Manta is 3x. And the CETO wrap ETH is 19.5x. So you want to make sure <clears throat> that you jump into a pool that has a really high multiplier because a lot more tokens are devoted to that pool. So as we can see, the strategic AI Manta has the less emissions of, a, of only a 3x, but I still jumped into that pool because I do have strategic AI tokens that I want to use. And this right here still has a really high APR. Now, when it comes to, of course, the native pools like the CETO USDX and the CETO Wrap ETH, we know these are going to have the higher multipliers. That's why I jumped into the CETO USDX because it has a 22X. A lot of the token emissions are dedicated to this um, particular pool over here and also the CETO Wrap ETH. So that's the one thing that you have to think about. Now, everybody's not gonna think the same exact way or have the best strategy in mind because everybody's situation is different when it comes to the farms. Now, if you're trying to get a really good position and not serve any impermanent loss and not worry about the, your, your tokens going up and down in value, your LPs, right? You wanna jump in to the stable pair over here. This is still giving now a decent 11X, which is pretty good. And the APR for a stable LP is magnificent when you're talking about 439%. Now. When it comes to the native pools, the CETO USDX and the CETO Wrap ETH, we do have to worry about impermanent loss. Okay, so what am I saying here? I'm basically saying, let's say you're, you buy the tokens at 18 cents and the price goes down to, let's say, 12 cents. You serve a loss in the value of your tokens, a 33% loss. So that means your LP is going to go down in value as well. But because this LP is paired up with a stable coin, is gonna serve a lot less of a hit versus it being paired to wrap ETH. Now, wrap ETH right now, price is strong. You know, ETH been tearing it up, but these two tokens are going to be a little bit volatile. So that means the price is gonna fluctuate up and down. That's why the APR is a lot more stronger when it comes to the CETO wrap ETH because of that impermanent loss factor. So for me, my decision was, let me pair the CETO token up with the USDX. So another thing that you wanna worry about over here with the wrap ETH slash Manta, is that this is a good pool that basically is a non-native pool that you are getting an 8x multiplier you are getting 730 percent but you don't have to really worry about the CETO token and the price being volatile going up and down we we know that manta right now is pretty stable it's around the three dollars and 20 cents range wrap ETH is pretty stable itself so we are going to serve some permanent loss or we could take some price appreciation with that as well depending on the market so we know that this right here is a pretty safe call, but you are not going to get that heavy multiplier like you would with the CETO, uh, the native pools like the CETO USDX or the CETO Wrap ETH. So as you can see, many options over here and many things that you gotta think about and consider. And of course, there is no right answer. There's only one right answer that's for you because that's your situation. For me personally, I jumped into the CETO USDX because I felt like I am early to the party. I felt like the price of this token might explode to 50 cents, 60 cents, because I know with SparkSwap, it went over a dollar 
So I'm saying because I'm kind of early to this party, very early to this party, I have room for the price appreciation. And of course, I'm gonna be getting a lot of CETO tokens in the process because I have a higher multiplier, which is that 22X over here, all right? So anyway, let's talk about the next thing, which is very, very exciting, which is going to be the what? The CETO 404. So I know you guys heard about the 404 and how the 404 hype is going crazy right now. A lot of projects want to implement the 404, but they're not doing it in a very effective way. Now, this is the first project that I've seen over here that's going to implement the 404 in a way that is going to help sustain the project because it has a use case, right? The 404 must have a use case and the use case right here is basically saying, if you hold the 404 tokens in your wallet, you are going to receive a portion of all protocol revenue. That means the swap fees, the bridge fees, right? The bot profits and our future exchange coming very soon. That means the more 404 tokens you have, the more you are going to receive the protocol revenue. Guys, that is super bullish. And another bullish aspect is that the only way for you to get the CETO 404 is to swap it with the CETO token. So right now, as I'm farming, right, I'm saying to myself, yo, if I'm farming, I'm getting all this CETO token. And at the time of the launch, he's saying that it's going to be around 250 bucks, but the price might rise. I'm going to need a certain amount of CETO tokens in order to get a few of those four fours, because the more you have, the more you're going to get the protocol revenue share. So that for me right there is super bullish because now the four fours ain't just pictures, ain't just NFTs. Obviously, these are actually tokens that have a use case that I'm going to want to keep because I'm going to be earning a value of the protocol share. So that right there, guys, is super awesome. And I believe this is going to be launching next week. Not too sure about the exact date and time, but of course you wanna stay tuned to the Telegram and the Discord in order to get all that latest and greatest information. So again, if you want to learn how to bridge, please watch my previous video. I showed you guys how to bridge, but anyway. Next step is to figure out which farm you want to jump into. I gave you guys a lot of information of ways to think about things and how it pertains to your own financial situation. So for example, let's say you want to jump into the CETO USDX over here, or you want to jump into the CETO wrap ETH. You already know you're going to have to go to the trade and then jump to where? To the exchange. Once you jump to the exchange, you should have some USDC from your bridging or you got some wrap ETH, whatever you have, and then you're just gonna swap out the tokens, right? All of the tokens that you need, guys, are right here for you. The wrap ETH, the USDC, you know, the, the strategic AI, the USDX, the CETO, and the Manta. All that stuff is right here. Now, if you don't see any token over here, guys, you can go back to where? The Discord. So all you gotta do is copy and paste the contract addresses and you are good to go. Now, you're gonna swap it out. Everybody knows how to swap things out. So always worry about price impact. If you're trying to swap out large amounts of money, price impact is over two or 3%. That's not a good look. Make sure you do it in small chunks to be saving that money. That's just some advice that I wanna give you. Not financial advice, but just some advice. So this is the liquidity tab that you're going to click on. And then you're gonna click on add liquidity. So let's say you do have some CETO tokens and you do have some what, some USDX over here. All you gotta do is enter the amount. You definitely wanna go to the max amount and click over here. Next is going to do the 50% um, on both ends for you. Then you're gonna have to approve it first and then you're gonna have to um, approve the CETO, approve the USDX, and then you're gonna click on supply. I didn't do that step right here for the video because I already approved it already so it doesn't show. But next and last step, you're gonna click on supply. And next, you're gonna confirm supply over here. And then you're gonna, uh, of course, pay your gas fee and you are good to go, all right? So that's pretty much it, guys. And then once you get your LP tokens, you're gonna head back to the farms. And then you're gonna go to the appropriate pool. And then you are going to, you know, click on, like I already approved this transaction over here. So I'm gonna click on the plus sign. 
if you want to add more LPs. If you if this is your first time, you wanna approve the contract and then you're going to click on the plus button to add and then you're gonna click on max over here and then you're gonna confirm and then you're gonna pay your gas fee and then your, your, your tokens are state. If you wanna take some tokens away, of course you just press the subtraction sign and I could click on max or portion of my tokens, whatever you want. Press confirm, pay the gas fee, you are good to go. So if you just wanna harvest your tokens, guys, all you gotta do is click on the harvest button over here, pay your gas fee, and the tokens will go straight to your wallet. Or if you go to the home page over here, I really like the fact that they have it right here and organized to show you how much tokens is in your wallet. Also, the amount of tokens that you are able to harvest, right? And the TVL is looking pretty, pretty good, especially for the first four hours. I think this is definitely gonna pass over a million or even two million. People are probably just waiting to bridge over the fees. So that's why I'm dropping the video nice and early, of course. And of course, if you wanna, you know, get these plays even earlier than right now, guys, head to the Moonshot Max, of course, official telegram. This is where I drop all the projects that I'm, I'm gonna be talking about very early. So people already have the latest and greatest information. The link to my telegram will be down below. So guys, there you have it, right? On the Manta blockchain, we got Cedo swap farms that are live. We are getting a thousand percent APR. And guys, the Cedo 44 is a great aspect to this farm because we are going to be sharing in that protocol revenue. Man, this is gonna be awesome. Let's see how this one develops. So hit that like, smash that subscribe for your boy because this is your boy, Moonshot Max, taking you straight to the moon. I'm gonna see you guys in my next video pretty, pretty soon. So peace out.